depends on my taste. Right. So right. to me, this is a little bit. When your ancestors say stop. You stop when the ancestors tell you it's enough. <laughs> Look. <laughs> I don't put the ancestors so say no. Y'all wanna know what's okay, crazy? Stop. That's funny. Wow. We've all said the same things all our lives. Our grandparents. Pretty much. Their grandparents, when your ancestors tell you to stop, where did it originate from? For real, like where did it come from? For us to be on different continents saying the same exact things. And and like, like we understand what we're saying when we're putting the season right, down. Like right. We know to just eyeball it and be like... Mm -hmm. when, when the yeah. ancestor says, stop, my child. Mm -hmm. What's good, good y'all? It's, it's the Dumashets React, and we're back with another video. Who we got today, see? Today we're back with another American reaction. Super excited about this video, guys. If you're new to us and, and we're new, new to you, you, make sure you scroll down, hit, hit that subscribe button, button, and turn on the post notification bell because we're, we're on the road to 100K. And we cannot get there without you guys, all right? Join the family. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Oh. So we're gonna have no honey worms. No honey worms. This is the size of your pinky. One more honey worm. So y'all more honey worms look like the caterpillars that be on yeah, our tree yeah, the with the hair coming out the backs of it. The, the ones big that, juicy ones, you know, the ones that was on the line came. You know, the one that when Simba was more. lost and he needed to go eat some food for the introducing him to the Mopani worms and the beetles and stuff. You remember that? No. Nothing <laughs> I don't remember that. Okay. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, but they do look like our caterpillars. And I think that's what throws me off. Mm-hmm. So, we're going to see. It's different now. I see someone actually holding it. In. Yeah, we learned to cook it. Oh, it's not cooked already? No. Oh. See, that's... Uh, that's the head, that's the tail, and it's got a few spiky things on the back, them ones. Anyway, yeah. most of them have come off because it's okay. dry, it's been dried, oh, it. uh, boiled and dried. So now that we want to prepare it, so, this, so all these are dry mukali worms. Yeah. So, what do they call this one? Ma huh. I, I don't know. Ma Harat. Madora. Oh, Harat. I know Madora. So, this is the Pani word. So far, it's giving me like um, um, frozen uh, shrimp. Dried shrimp. Or dried shrimp. Dried shrimp. Yeah. Okay, if you say dried shrimp, that, that may convince me to try it. <sighs> Lord Jesus. You okay? Yeah, this is different. It's I different. thought this was take out the bag and eat. No, no, no. But they, that, she about to actually like cook and make a dish out of it. Okay, all right. We're we going to see if, if at the end Sierra's going to try it. But so far, if you are new here, Dion has a no, dare. Okay. Not a dare, but what what is it? What is it? Our supporters... So that Dion has to eat the Mopani worms as soon as we come off of the airplane. You need all 88. So if we get to a thousand likes. You need all 88,000 people yeah. to know about this? Yes. If we get to a thousand likes, I'm going to try it. I, I stand on my word. That's what's up. Get it I'm to a proud of likes. you. That is a bar. Yes, a, a thousand, thousand likes. likes. Okay. That's, that's, and we're yeah. going to play this clip back in our vlog when we come to South Africa. And if it's I'm half sure. of a thousand, she'll eat a piece of it. All right, let's get it. See, whoa, whoa, too late. <laughs> <laughs> After and that's big enough to crack and have almost baby. almost like thirty minutes in water, so that they can get soft they get before soft. we cook them. Okay, so we'll dry drain the water. Get rid of some impurities if there are any. The water is already starting to clear. Yeah, that's what I was waiting to see. 
Mm-hmm. Gotta clean it down to the T. Gotta That's get all the extra the stuff off. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 So far, so good. I'm gonna use a wooden spoon. I need. Oh. Who's the cameraman? Why he did this? That's <laughs> why. <laughs> Okay, so I'm, I'm visualizing. Make it soft. Right. Cooking oil, regular cooking oil. I'm uh, vegetable. It's vegetable oil. I'm a salt. Little, like, yeah, gotta get some salt in there. In Sitswana, Litswai. Litswai. In Shona, South. Munyu. <laughs> I forget. Too many languages. I forget. In Shona, Munyu. In Sitsona, let's why. Let's why. In English, salt. Mm. In Afrikaans, salt. In slang, Sitsona slang, see how they run. <laughs> In Sitsona, <laughs> see how they run. <laughs> Reason, <laughs> see how they run. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. So you just put it, <laughs> oh my god, just put a bit of oil, not too much, that will be it. Now the difference between yeah. the difference between fire stoves and electric stoves, you can control your fire and yeah. I feel like that just like gives it that, like you can do what you want faster, you know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. with it, instead of waiting for that electricity to do its job for you. Right, I love I like the fire. Uh, gas stoves. Mm -hmm. yeah. Bit of that oil. <clears throat> yeah, just to cover the board, you know, the pan. The whole pan should be covered. So soft, and then, fry. It wasn't really oil. That's my son. Get up. Okay. You need fire. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There you go. Let's be cavemen. <laughs> <laughs> caveman style. You need fire. <laughs> Two sticks, rub them together, you get fire. Lord. There you go. And then I don't have to wait for it to be hot because this country is hot. This oil is hot as it is. Don't worry about the sound because you know it behaves when there's people around. It won't do that. It's very hot. It's a hot country. You can just put them in there. Okay. Mm, this is very different. Just this is our first time seeing it broken down like this. Yeah. We got. Uh, we don't want to use too much salt because salt is not very good for you. So we put only a little bit, and what I call a little bit depends on my taste. Right. So right. to me, this is a little bit. When your ancestors say stop. You stop when the ancestors tell you it's enough. <laughs> <laughs> I stop when the ancestors say no. Y'all wanna know what's okay, crazy? That's, that's funny. Wow. We've all said the same things all our lives. Our grandparents, pretty much, their grandparents. When your ancestors tell you to stop, where did it originate from? For real, like where did it come from? For us to be on different continents saying the same exact things, and and like, like we understand what we're saying when we put in the season right, down. Like right. we know to just eyeball it and be like, mm hmm. When when the yeah. ancestor says stop, my child, mm. <laughs> we stop. Well, what does that sound like? That's that's, that's for another story. <laughs> that will do. And then you get now. Nah, I need. Uh oh, there I it goes this. cracking. You can put any spice that you like. Well, we like brine, mm. so we're gonna use a brine seasoning. This is Texan step. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Now, I've yeah. never heard anybody say whether they mopani worms be like, you know, spicy or mild. Mm -hmm. I've never heard anyone mention it. Yeah. Like, is that a way to season it? Like, to way, to your taste where you want it spicy? Mm -hmm. Or is that like something that's kind of like unheard of? You eat it mild. Right, because if I put some seafood ball seasoning on oh, there, yeah, it's gonna I'll eat it, baby. Yeah, it's going to eat it. Seafood ball goes just about anything. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. It's good. Just put as much as you want. Just put as much as you want. 
them. There are plenty of them. <laughs> One for luck. And luck. And luck. Fuck, I don't want it. Oh, that's really for put a lot. <laughs> okay, this one. Woo. I don't know why I feel like this is the The fire shouldn't be a lot, so you turn it down so that you can keep on turning it, mixing, turning it. Remember that it was boiled already, so it's actually okay yeah. the way it is. But because we don't, we don't know who boiled it. We just bought it. To be fair, we don't know who did it. So we gonna wash them and redo them. Mm -hmm. Always, but right, in all yeah. honesty. But also, you can actually. Right. It don't matter what we buy. Anytime we get a food product, you be like, hey, clean it. I need you to put that in some water and make sure you get all the stuff that don't need to be on the elf. Mm -hmm. I, I I think personally, if you don't, like, for instance, if you get fish and you don't clean your fish, you can taste the difference. Yeah, you Regardless really if can. you just go straight to the side cooking it, you yeah. got to you gotta rinse that off. That's why I cannot get with the already seasoned meat from the store. Because mm. y'all not going to clean that meat how I'm going to clean it. Mm. Okay, so I'm going to season my own food. Mm -hmm. Only there's no spices and things like that they only just boiled so we keep on turning them on that's too little fire if you want to put chili you can put chili i like them dry some people will put onion and whatever and make them as true i don't really like the texture when they're too soggy i like them a little crunchy so that we eat them the way we eat peanuts when okay. we're watching a movie or when we're playing 30 seconds which I'm very good at. Well, <laughs> that's a nice to know. She's so funny. Mm -hmm. We like them to look nice. See? Is there anything that can make them look a little bit red, like a bit of color? Tomato? Um, what can I do? A little bit of meat. One red tape. A little bit of meat. Okay. But you don't like hot food, man. No, I'm just putting a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. This time it's a little bit. Like, like that's a lot. A little bit of meat. <laughs> yeah, but you don't like hot food. <laughs> it won't hurt anybody. Okay. So from, I'm getting that she likes her spicy. Yeah. Okay, okay. We, can, okay. we put salt. We need to put black pepper as well. Okay. Black pepper. Okay. Come on, let the pepper come out. Yeah, that's it. That's enough black pepper. And then you, because I'm the one that's cooking, I get to taste halfway through. Mm. Okay. Is that not hot? You're going to burn. Yeah, she didn't blow. She is a pro. Mm -hmm. She make it look good. Ah, the heat. It taste a bit of heat there. But they need to get a bit drier than they are. Cook it down some more. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Spicy. Do <laughs> you like a glass of water there, Ma? <laughs> Now this reminds me when we're doing seafood bars, you know what I'm saying, mm. and Sierra's in the kitchen with all the crawfish bar seasoning, and I, I smell it, yeah. you know what I'm saying, the seasoning alone <laughs> makes you want to sneeze and cough a little, but when I hit the corn, I see her on the counter leaning with the bag, talking about some, I oh, love that seasoning. You want, is it too hot in here? <laughs> <laughs> you want to put the fan on? You make me want some now. I do want some. I like how you make it though. I'm just jumping. Okay. Oh, bro. I tell you. Nice. So you keep on turning and turning and turning. If you come a bit closer, you see how it's been coated. It looks a lot more thicker and juicier now. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, I think that's yeah. Look at that. Just enough oil to cover all the honey worms. 
just enough. African style. And just a bit of education. Are they not soggy now that they've been cooked? No, no. Because that's why we, we keep on turning them. We're trying to get rid of the water um, and get them to be a bit dry. So we turn down the heat and literally just carry on turning and turning and turning. And look at that. Oh my goodness. I'll taste this one. Now, this is one good. bite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Different. That is good. That is perfect. That that is so perfect. Didn't they say it tastes like fish? They have said that, didn't they? But I think that's fresh out the bag without it being cooked down. I don't know. Mmm. I, again, we've never seen it cooked down. Right, and it, it makes me think about it differently now. Which one? The one that's not cooked or the one that is cooked? The one that's being cooked. What you think about it? I don't know. Because the way it looks, it looks like it plumped up more. Yeah. And she she added the water to it when mm. she was cleaning it, so it make it look a little juicier. Mm. So the way it looks, it looks like you're looking like you like the more pine worms more than me now. <laughs> I'm just saying uh, yeah. that I would try it at a thousand likes. Or five hundred. Thousand. Lots of protein. Yeah, a lot I heard that too. Protein. You can get. This is healthy protein. These things eat leaves. A mopani tree. They eat the leaves of the mopani tree. That's why they're called mopani worms. And um. So we eat them. It's different from, and they don't have any antibiotics and things like that. They're wild. Not like the cow or the goat that, that's literally given all sorts of things. Or okay. it's sick and it's given something, antibiotic and some growth hormone maybe to make them big. These ones are natural. So we'll leave them to dry. We'll leave them to dry a little. And then later on in the night, while we're watching telly, we'll have a drink. Penny worms, oh, it's hot. My gosh, <laughs> I'm burning up. So while we're watching telly and we are playing 30 seconds or whatever we're doing, we enjoy that. That's more penny worm. I hope you enjoyed watching that. I can eat another one just for... <laughs> oh, so it goes for a third one, y'all. Just for in case. Just in case. Just for sure. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Man. Okay. Okay, yeah. It, now, it did plump up. It looks different for us. Yeah. But the way she was explaining everything, I would be open to trying it now. Look, look, look at that. That's all it took is one good, th hey, when you cook it right, the first time, mm -hmm. that's how you create a person's memory taste yeah. to want it again. They like if you, it. yeah, if you make it wrong and then we taste it like, oh, whoa, wait a minute. What's that? Then somebody be like, yeah, they didn't make it right, bro. Mm -mm. You need to try it this way. Mm -mm. That's how you get the, uh, somebody's actually like it. You know what right. I'm saying? Right, right. Um, and then I'm glad she broke down the health benefits of it about how it only eats these certain things and mm -hmm. it's, it's it's clean. Right. It's clean. And she put some Texas seasoning, so I'm yeah, guessing yeah. it's like more barbecue. I don't know, y'all. I think right. I think I think this one sold us almost. It's more it's, yeah. I've been had my mind made up. <laughs> okay. Right out the airport. We gonna do it. Now I think we should go right into the uh the, the kitchen with it. Oh yeah, we got we don't I bring it in y'all call. I need yeah. to see y'all make it. Y'all gotta make it like this, like it was made in this video. Don't catch okay. me slipping out there. <laughs> Talking about the, my pony worm. Yeah, okay. And it's and it's dirty. Mm. Straight off the stove. 
Yeah, see, and there's no difference because when we eat, we like to eat and see our food made. We like to see who's cooking it. We like to see the love that's being pushed mm -hmm. into it. All that good stuff really does matter. So, yes. Shout out to her with this video. This is Miss Rose, right? Mm -hmm. Shout out to Miss Rose. Make sure you guys go check her channel out. Let us know uh, that we sent y'all. Yes. So, we hope you guys enjoyed this video with us. Like this video, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. We have enabled our super, super thanks if you like to support the channel that way, as well as our reaction request form is in our description box below. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace.